I've been holding this off for a little bit, but I have some rolls of dimes here that I had for a while, and one of them has a silver dime on the inside. And I happened to pick up about another 70 or so dollars here in dimes for me to hunt, so this is going to be another small hunt from my uh, quarter hunt, so not only am I going to be finding silver in the quarters today, I'm also going to be finding silver in this roll of dimes. If I could get it open. So this one right there. It's a Loria portrait. What year is it going to be? 1955. Nice. Put that up on the board. I wonder if there was anything else. Well, just a sea of modern and one silver dime. That's really weird. Hmm. So, I'm going to start going through these dimes and I'll call you guys back in if I happen to find something. So, it looks like I'm going to find another silver dime. And it looks like it's right there. So, let's see what it is. Oh! Oh! A really nice 1965. It's in pretty decent shape. It's like blast white. Sweet. So that's going to be number two. That's pretty awesome. 65 and a 55. Huh. Ten years apart from each other. So. Don't see any foreigns. Some American right there. About another eight or so rolls to go. I'll call you guys back in once I start finding more interesting stuff like this. Sweet. Fourth roll from the last, and I see another silver dime. They're gonna have to call me the king of dimes because I'm finding silver periodically again. Sweet. And it's going to be a Loria portrait. Oh, hey, look, a 1960. It's got some scratches on it, but oh well. Silver, silver, and I'll take it. Another 80 percenter. And I have three more rolls to go. So let me go through the rest of these rolls. If I happen to find something cool, I'll call you guys back in. But before I go, if some of you viewers haven't seen our 150th anniversary dime, this is what it basically looks like. It's a maple leaf. It's pretty sweet. So, I'm going to go through the rest of these, and then I'll call you guys back in if I happen to find some. So I'm on to the last roll, and let's see if there's anything inside. And it looks like that's what it's all going to be. It's just a bunch of nickel. Pretty good hunt in my personal opinion. So, I'm going to go through the rest of these, and I'll call you guys for the wrap-up. So from $75 in dimes, that's not too bad, but the American department is looking a little thin. Only 60 cents in American dimes right there. A 1955 silver dime. A 1960 silver dime. And a really nice 1965 silver dime. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this little bit of a hunt. Like and subscribe to my channel. It really helps out a lot. And stay tuned for more videos down the road. You know the moral of the story? Happy hunting.